Chill advisory in effect until noon today. Those feels like temperatures anywhere from 15 to as low as 30 degrees below zero as we head through the morning hours. Camera shaking Methodist Women's Hospital right now. That's with the northwest wind. Air temperature right at zero at Eppley right now. Sustained wind 15 miles per hour. Wrapping that feels like temperature 19 below at the moment. So most spots between 15 and 25 below down to 26 below Columbus and Norfolk. The wind 10 to 20 miles per hour. It's possible we could see gusts 25, maybe even 30 miles per hour during the early morning hours. So of all days, uh, kiddos heading to the bus stop. Parents make sure multiple layers, the gloves, the hats, everything, because around seven o'clock likely feeling between 20 and 25 below zero. And that's when we could get uh, frostbite possible in as little as 30 minutes. By the afternoon, it's still cold. Though the wind not quite as strong, highs today going to struggle to make it out of the single digit. So the strongest winds will be early on this morning and gradually uh, calming down as we go to the late afternoon and especially through the evening. So we've got some clouds around now, likely clearing out. So we'll see sunshine around lunchtime, but temperatures again in the lower single digits. Wind chill still probably 5 to 10 below zero. A few more clouds though moving in late this afternoon and through the evening and there may be a few flurries out to the west, but uh, the dryer is going to eat that up. So not looking at any snow chances tonight and uh, really for the next week. The snow is down to our south moving through parts of Kansas, Missouri right now and on the way toward Nashville. So winter storm parts of Tennessee, Kentucky and West Virginia today. Some spots could pick up around half a foot of snow. High pressure though is going to build in here, so that's going to calm the wind down this evening and then it moves off to our east by tomorrow morning. So we're going to pick up more of a south breeze. You see those isobars close together. It's going to be fairly breezy tomorrow, so it's going to still drop those wind chills likely below zero in the morning, but by the afternoon temperatures will improve into the 20s, but the real warm up. Well, it's coming on Saturday, so for the weekend Saturday is going to be the better day to spend any time outside because a uh, cold front is going to knock us back down Sunday highs in the 20s, but that cold not going to last too long. Look at the end of the seven day forecast mid 40s on Tuesday, possibly near 50 degrees on Wednesday. But today it's about that dangerous cold impact icon in with the wind chill advisory again until noon.